Social sector problems are complicated, and trying to solve them is a big challenge. Many of the organisations that are devoted to addressing these challenges need to constantly adapt and improve their ways of working to meet the demands of a rapidly changing world. But how can they find the tools and the methods that can help them? Innovation can often seem like some magical activity that just isn't like real life. This is where the DIY toolkit comes in. DIY stands for Development, Impact and You. The DIY toolkit is a collection of the best and most practical social innovation tools that we could find. The toolkit has been specially designed to help people working in the development sector to invent, adopt or adapt their ideas to deliver better results. And it's completely free for you to download from the internet, remix and share. It's brought to you by Nesta, in partnership with the Rockefeller Foundation. We believe that people can be more successful and have more impact in the work that they're doing if they know how to innovate better. The toolkit is our first go at bringing together the best social innovation tools in one place. Over the last 12 months, we've spoken to hundreds of people just like you to find out what they really need and what is it that they really want. We have researched hundreds of tools and selected 30 that we think can be really useful and we have tested them in a wide range of situations to make sure they can help people to be more effective. Many people and organizations around the world have kindly helped us to test out early prototypes of the tools. We have co-created this toolkit to give you the skills and the confidence to try things out and bring your ideas to life. The tools are quick to use and easy to apply. You can use them on your own or in a group. And you can freely download the worksheets and print them off in various sizes. You can find any tool that may help you with your work by looking at the overview of issues you might be struggling with. Just take a look and try it out. The instructions for using the worksheets are really practical and there are many stories about the tools being used by various people and organizations around the world. You can also rate each tool and share your story of how you got on with other people. And if you have the time, there is some further information about social innovation for you to read up on. The DIY toolkit is standing on the shoulders of giants and we are very happy to acknowledge that. All the key references to the original sources are available for you to see and follow up on. There's no shortages of challenges for the development sector. The DIY toolkit is just at the beginning and can only get better. We'll add more tools and more approaches over time. And the more that we can learn from you about what's working and what's not, the better the toolkit will be.